Welcome back to the channel. Today, as promised, we will see how to install the video driver on Windows 98 running on Android Virtual Machine. Also, if you are interested, in the last part of the video I'll explain how to install DirectX 8.1. Before we begin, I remind you to activate the bell to be notified for new videos. Then, for using the virtual machine from the previous video, I had the floppy image, select STD as the VGA display and run the machine. The IMG file is available in the description box. Once Win98 is ready, by enabling the mouse trackpad mode with the back button, you can open a drop down menu on the desktop by pressing the volume down button. In this menu I select properties. In the window that appears, I go to settings, then advanced and finally adapter. Click change and then next. I choose display a list of all drivers in a specific location, so you can select the driver you want. And then next. After clicking on disk driver, I leave A as the path to copy the file from and click OK. A new window should show VBE mini port standard graphic adapter VGA as a compatible model. Ok and then next. You need to insert the Windows 9X VBEMP driver disk. I select ok and then browse to change path. The VBE.VXD driver is located in log folder. After confirming there is a copy of the new files. The driver installation is finished, now you need to configure the screen color and resolution. Before proceeding with the configuration, it is necessary to restart the system. Now a delicate phase begins. Once the operating system is ready, I go to properties as I did before. I change the screen resolution to 1024 by 768 but when I change the colors I have problems with the resolution. Then I reboot again. Subsequently a hardware incompatibility error may appear. For this reason, I only change the colors and choose 65,536 colors and restart the system. At startup, I notice that the colors have changed and I decide to apply a theme by going to start settings, control panel. In the new window I click on desktop themes and choose Windows 98 plus 65536 colors and confirm. Returning to the control panel, I click on display, change screen area to 1024 by 768 in the settings tab and apply the changes. This time a message appears confirming the new settings. I select yes. Finally, I also change the arrangement of the desktop background by going to the background tab and I set display to stretch. At this point the screen configuration is finished. If you are interested in how to install DirectX 8.1 you can keep following the video. This part is not necessary. 
In the main menu of the Limbo app, I add the hdd underscore boot dot img file as hard drive B and run the Windows 98 SE machine. When the system is ready, I go to my computer and select D. Inside, there is the DirectX 8.1 folder. I open it and click on the X setup. DirectX setup starts. I accept the license agreement by clicking on yes. Now I proceed with the installation by pressing on install. The program searches for DirectX runtime components. After completing the operation, the system must be restarted. At startup, system settings are being updated and a new driver database is being created. Once finished, the installation is complete. Now you can enjoy Windows 98 on your Android device. Thanks for watching. Activate the bell for new videos and subscribe to the channel. See you next time.